So fast forward 11 years. Here I am with another challenging deadline. But this time, it's not only my mental, my physical and emotional well-being that is at stake here. Now I'm a mom. So I signed a contract, and I'm really excited about this project. I've partnered with a team that is going to help me produce my own art courses online. So let me explain some of the challenges of the project. I have six to eight weeks to create nine paintings, do all the filming, the editing, and also just the curriculum. And then I'm also a full-time mom during the day. So I needed to focus on the first part of the project and that was the paintings. And I figured out in order to make this deadline, I needed to get all the paintings done in the first three weeks. So I had nine paintings in three weeks. I had no idea how I was going to complete this, but I was also really excited because I've spent the last 10 years working in education and then before that was working in film and then my whole life I've spent working as an artist and it feels like for the first time all of my passions are suddenly coming together. What this would mean is that I could build something for myself and I wanted to be good. I want to share everything I know. What it would mean is that I get to have more time with my daughter if I can do this as a profession. goes by so quickly and you never get it back again. extremely challenging for six to eight weeks. So I just had to tough it out. The first week was rough. So we spent all of our time inside of the house, but I didn't know how to figure out how to keep the house clean, how to cook, how to get everything done during the daytime because it was a new schedule. It was summer, so in California, that's like our winter. It was scorching hot. got the paintings done. It's a blast. It's a blast. But by the end of the week, I just crashed into the weekend until I could finally get a little bit of rest and sleep in. Happy birthday to you. Yay! Ava turned two. I wanted to find some balance. It was important to me for her to have that. No. No, 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 no. Come on, out we go. But I also needed balance too.
So we went to the Getty and it felt like freedom. My mission had become, how am I gonna give this girl a beautiful childhood? Something that when she looked back at this time, that she thought of good memories. Maybe she wouldn't even remember it. But all I wanted to do was fill her life with beauty, with happiness and love. My mom came and she helped so much. I was able to feel like I was starting to wrap my head around how I was going to get everything done. It just felt so good having her there too, just my daughter and my mom, and it just made me feel safe. After my mom left, I was back into that routine again of just trying to get everything done. Fortunately though, the paintings that I had finished this week were part of the same series, so Everything kind of became routine and I was able to complete it without really thinking about the process too much. I'm starting to feel the effects of sleep deprivation. But I had a new challenge. The next week, I would have to start paintings for a completely new course. And I had nothing planned yet. The weekend came and we had an opportunity to do something that felt normal. We went to an outdoor concert and it was exactly what we needed. Being able to go to an event like this kind of 
refreshed me. It made me feel like I could tackle anything. It kind of reminded me of my old self. Instead of panicking and instead of like worrying about how everything was going to get done, something just kicked in and I just figured out how I was going to do the project and just started to do it. And I didn't want to think about the future. I didn't want to think about what had to be done after the paintings were done because that would be a challenge in itself when the time came. Right now I just wanted to live in the moment. I just wanted to watch her dance. Because isn't that the thing about life? Nothing is ever going to be the way that you imagined it to be. The challenges will make the good times better. And the good times that you have help push you through the hard times.